what's up welcome back to another video on my channel so sorry i've been so mia for a while but um i was trying to figure out what i should post and i was just really busy with this thing that i'm going to be telling you so about a month or two ago yeah like a month ago um I went with my dad and I spent the whole week with him at the fair and they show in 4-H and so my stepmom told me um if you help out like mucking out stalls and feeding the horses and bathing them and doing all of that then um or if you're like a big help while, while we're at the fair then I'll consider getting you a horse and showing next year. So you know me, um, I was working my butt off that week and she tells me literally even before like the fair week starts, like as soon as we get there and we unpack and everything and she says, so we just sold a your dad's grandpa's house so now we have enough money to buy you a horse and so you know me already getting so happy and hyper right and so i immediately start looking like while i'm at my mom's house just like on facebook or on the internet or like some website or something and my dad sends me a picture of this palomino paint if I can find a picture of her, I'll insert it here. But um, he finds the picture of her, and her name is Belle. Um, she was a gated saddlebred horse, I believe. And when I first saw her, I absolutely fell in love with her. I just did not fall in love with the fact that she was gated because I don't really want gated horse like I just want a normal horse that like normal people in the fair would be showing like I didn't want to be out of the blue like not ordinary because it would be my first year and like I didn't want to get made fun of and all those things because like I don't know it just really means a lot to me and so um that Belle was off of a Facebook page called Down the Road Horses and I like kept up with their Facebook page and stuff and I was like paying a lot of attention to it like talking to my dad about going to see Belle and all these things and so one day they post this cute guy right here and He's nothing like Belle, but I absolutely fall in love with him way more than I fell in love with Belle. And he was just so cute and stuff. And so I texted my dad about it and he was like, okay, we're going to see both of them this weekend when you come over. And so I was like so excited and all these things. and. I was just like ready to go see them and like ready to see if I would get one of these and I would like one of them enough to show them in the fair. And we went and seen them and turns out Belle was sold. She sold the day that we got there and so we only got to see Phoenix which we rode him and everything me and my stepmom did which my dad's gonna be riding him sometimes when I'm not at their house, but my dad was too sore to ride him. And so me and my stepmom rode him and we really liked him. And he was really sweet. The only thing I did not like about him was um, how fast he was because I'm gonna be doing like Western pleasure or English um, pleasure and stuff like that and showmanship like all the classes where you pretty much just need to be like a slow show horse and so I didn't like how fast he was and I didn't think that when we got him he'd be going to training and he'd be slowed down and so I told my stepmom that I liked everything about him just that he was too fast for me and maybe too much for me 
And she said, well, I'm not too worried about that because we're going to send him to training when we get him anyway, so he'll be slowed down. So then immediately I like fall in love even more and I'm telling him, I'm like, I really want him. I really want him. He feels like the right horse. And so then we're sitting in the car and we're like, okay, let's go to dinner and let's think about all of this. And so we don't end up going to dinner. We just drive around and then we find these other people on the website and um, they have like multiple horses. So we set up um, a time to go see all those other horses. And then the lady says that the one that we were really interested in sold. And so I was kind of thinking, I was like, okay, well maybe all of these things aren't meant to work out because my stepmom already went to see one and she, or the people who were selling her got the money that they needed and then they didn't want to sell her anymore, I guess. And then the second one sold and like Phoenix was the only one left after that. And then Star also sold, which is the other one we were going to see. And so I was basically just like, okay, well then Phoenix has to be the one and all of these things. And I was like so excited and I was like, how is this working out so good? Like the one horse that I want, everything is working um, against any other horse being the one, you know? So basically really fell in love with Phoenix and everything was falling into place where he was going to be the one that I was going to get. So I'm going to read his ad. Okay, so this is the Facebook page. I don't, it's gonna show up backwards, but I'll try to get a picture and insert it. And so on Phoenix's ad, it says, Phoenix is a six-year-old gelding, quarter horse paint. And for most of you, horse people that means he's six years old he's a fixed male horse and the quarter horse pain is just his breed so if you're not a horse person that doesn't really matter stands at 15 one bald faced with two blue eyes gray all-around horse walk trot and canter to die for backs nice willing to please afraid of nothing bays loads and great for farrier and then saying how like his feet were trimmed and his teeth were floated um would make a nice all-around 4-h horse asking 4,000 located in Belleville, Michigan. So when I first seen his ad I was like okay well that price is too much and my dad was like telling me the same thing too and so I was like okay so that's probably not gonna happen right and then she goes well, if you really like him, I'll put payments on him and we'll get him. And so that made me super happy because I liked him so much and she was willing to pay the price for me to get him. And so I will show you guys the video, the ultimate video of the very cute Phoenix if you guys will even be able to see it. So that's basically the video. Um, then when we went to see him, um, they told us that he wasn't afraid of anything and that he was just like a really great all-around horse so we like really liked him and stuff and um then we went back there later that day and my stepmom put the payment on him and he is now my horse um so i now have a horse that is probably gonna be on this channel now quite a bit because that's gonna be my life now like two times a week. So I basically just wanted to tell you guys like everything about him since he would be on this channel a lot and how I felt about him. 
and I already told you guys what I would probably be doing with him. Um, I'd be showing him in the Gladwin County or Harrison County, or Clare County, sorry, Clare County or Gladwin County Fair, and Western and English, Pleasure, maybe Versatility, and then Showmanship. Um, not very sure on all of those, but those are like the ones that I'm thinking about. And then speed classes for fun and a costume class. And that's basically what I'm going to do with him. Um, while we're not at the fair and we're just at home, we'll probably trail ride, work on showmanship, or do speed for fun again. And then we may be doing some open horse shows around Michigan. So if you want to come see me at any of them, which I know that most of my subscribers live in the town that I live in, but if you still want to come see me at any of them, then I'll probably keep this channel updated on where I'm going. And so, yeah, that's all I have to tell you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Again, I'm very sorry for not being active. And I just wanted to update you guys on what's been happening and how come I've been so busy. So basically that's just what's consumed the last week or like two weeks, two and a half weeks of why I haven't been on YouTube. Other than the rest, it was just like trying to come up, come up with videos and things, but sorry for not being active. And I'm going to be coming back into that again, hopefully a lot this coming up so we're so I can post videos of the shows and things like that but yeah thank you guys so much for watching um I enjoy making videos so much so please make sure to like comment and sub or to like and subscribe and let me know what you want to see from me next in the comments below and I will see you guys in the next video bye